it's uh, a real pleasure to have uh, Prime Minister Vicenio here uh, from Belize. Uh, we have uh, uh, a lot to cover, but I'm really gratified that you've taken the time to uh, come to the State Department. Uh, Belize is a strong partner for the United States on so many issues of mutual concern. Uh, we are following up together on the very important meeting that President Biden and Vice President Harris had with CARICOM and uh, the leaders of, of CARICOM at the Summit of the Americas, working on a strong agenda together on climate, uh, on energy, on food security, uh, on finance. Uh, and I look forward to sharing some of the progress that we've made with the Prime Minister. Uh, as well, I should say, uh, congratulations on your recent Independence Day, uh, September 21st. Uh, but also, we appreciate so much Belize's strong voice on global issues, uh, including, for example, uh, the Russian aggression against Ukraine, uh, as well as its uh, strong ties to, to Taiwan. So, Prime Minister, welcome. Very good to have you here. Well, thank you very much, um, um, Secretary of State Lincoln, and thank you very much for inviting us over here at, um, at your office. As we all know that the United States and Belize have had very close, strong, and warm relations over the past 41 years. Yes. We just celebrated our 41st um, anniversary or independence. Um, last week, Wednesday, and you are right that there are so many issues that both countries we need to, to address. The issue of climate change, um, was it's almost like an ex existential threat yeah. for small yeah. countries like Belize that have a low um, line coastline, but it's also affecting big countries like mm. yourself, developed countries where in areas you have droughts, in other areas you have excessive rains, and it is something that has to be addressed by all of us, not by individuals. And Belize continues to have a stellar record when it comes to the protection of its environment. We have just signed an, an agreement with the, the Nature Conservancy and that we are going to protect 30% of our ocean space by 2026, four years ahead of, of schedule. And certainly the, the other issues of, of migration, um, the war in Ukraine where we strongly condemn the actions of, of Russia. Um, issues of uh, migration and also strengthening democracy in our region. So, um, thank you, um, Secretary, for inviting um, myself and my team to, to your office. Thank you. Thanks, everyone. Thanks. Prime Minister.